So I've been working on getting the valves out of the 327, uh, they're pretty stuck. I've got most of the exhaust valves out. I do have one more to go that actually broke off, but I've uh, been struggling with the intake valves. They're, uh, they're very tight um, and they just, they don't move. So I have gotten about four of them out. Um, I have another four or so to go here. Um, so this is what I found seems to work. I haven't found a better way to get these things out. This engine has solid lifters and they can be adjusted up and down. So what I have been doing is applying freeze off and PB blaster to the stems, trying to get them in as much as I can, letting them soak over the course of a week or so. Um, also had to use heat on the, uh, on the intake valves, shooting right in here through the intake ports and directly onto the valve stem and a little bit onto the, the guide. Um, but you can take these lifters here and you can adjust them up. And when you adjust them up, then it'll push the valve up, hopefully. Not all of them have done that, but most of them I've been able to get to, to move. Once the valve comes up like this, then I adjust the lifter back down and gain myself a little bit of space here. And I've been taking something to kind of wedge and give me a little bit of space between the valve stem and the lifter so it doesn't collapse all the way back down. And then tapping on the valve with a hammer, you can see how it goes down. Then I can take this and I can kind of push it back up. And you see the valve lift a little bit. <clears throat> And I'll keep doing this. Getting the valve moving. So now it's moving a little bit easier. I'm gonna hit it with some freeze off up on top. A little bit on the bottom. So it's getting easier to move every time now. All right, so once I get it moving, now I'm taking if I can fit this in there, that's a little bit too big. I'm gonna try a small one first. I'm just getting a little wrench up underneath if I'm able to, and then tapping it up with a sledge. Be careful, I still have my, my studs in here. This one's gonna be a little hard to access. Had a little bit more room on the other side. Might be able to get it in right here. There we go. So I'm gonna try to hold this down, hit it up, and see if we can get this thing to pop. And there we go. You see there's quite a bit of rust here. Lots of corrosion. That's why these things are so sticky. This one's gonna go in our number two intake. And then we can pull the spring and spring seats out. So that's another one down. I still have, what, four more to go? Awesome. Rinse and repeat. Hopefully I can get these other ones moving. We'll see.